Hello ladies and gentlemen. Um so as you already know I um I said in my previous video on how to pass your theory theory test first time tried and tested I said I said I said I was going to um do my car theory test and guess what I took it today and I passed strike 3 three times in a row I've passed my theory test without failing and I've never failed three times I've, I've, took, I've taken my theory test and I, and I have never failed um, that was two car theory tests I've taken now and one motorbike I've just taken the I've just taken the the the, the car theory test today at one o'clock today, one p.m. today, lunchtime ish, and yeah, like I said, I passed. Um, I, with in the actual theory test, in the actual theory test, I didn't actually get to finish all the questions. The last time I looked on the question in the, in the actual test center, uh, the test cen in the test center, I uh, I was up to like I was up to like. 44 questions and then after 44 questions after 44 questions I wasn't I, I seriously seriously wasn't looking at the um the questions I was only looking at the time because my time was running out because the reason why that is is because that um the, the the questions that they have the questions that they have on the actual um the questions that they have on the theory test the question that they have on the theory test CD which is this one <laughs> This one right here, the, the the theory test CD, um, the actual tests that are on are on, are on this, are the tests that are actually on this, and and mock tests that are on here, is not the same that when you go into the test center, they are similar in the test center, but they're not the exact, they're not the exact same, um. So, um, I did I did my mock test on the on this, I did my mock test on the CD five times, and I passed it five times. And I was getting it in the high 40s. At one stage in a mock in a, in a mock test on the CD, I actually got 50 questions correct out of 50, 50, 50 out of 50 correct correct questions. Um. Yeah. So. Um. So I passed that and. Um. Yeah, so I passed that. Um, yeah, passed that today. Um, I was just looking for my for the for the actual my two my two my three um certificates that I, that I passed my theory theory because in in a minute I'm just gonna sh I'm just gonna show you the proof that I actually passed my theory test. I'm gonna read it out in a few seconds. Um, what else can I say? Um, I can give one tip. Um. If you're an actor or an actress, you've got you've got an added added advantage of passing your theory test because um, the theory test is just all really just memorizing Im images and words. Most of it, most of it is just it's just words you have to remember and the way how the way how words are formed uh, or yeah, the, just the way how the words are formed in the sentence because sometimes in it well well in the in the test center the, in the test center they have um they have quite confusing questions and answers so it looks sort of, sort of like con I don't know if it conflicts but it's sort of like it just it's just not it's not blatant the questions not blatant so you can't you can't you can't when you're when you're doing the um when you're doing the when you're doing the actual test in the test center you can't actually go go on auto autopilot in the actual test center so you can't sort of like flick through the answers straight away because they're a bit more um it's a bit more. It's a bit more. You have to really sit down there and think about the questions because they're totally, dif totally different than than the ones in the actual um on the actual C D D D D S A C D. Um, because when I when I was doing the actual practice mock test on the on the D S A C D, I was actually going on going on at one stage. I was going on going on autopilot, where I was just like flicking through the answers. Just wasn't really re wasn't really sort of like taking my time type type of thing so um yeah so let me let me um let, let me um 
let me um show you the three the three tests that I've actually the three tests that I've actually passed in the in the, that I've actually passed previously. So This one, um, uh, yeah, this is the first. This is the first car car theory test back in um back in the ninth ninth of ninth of April, twenty ten. So as you can see, it's got the official DSA logo and. I don't know if you can see it. If you look where my finger is, I don't know if you can see it. I don't know if you can see it, but basically, you can see where it says "Congratulations, you have passed your passed the car, the car. Congratulations, you have passed the car dr driving theory tests." So you can see, I did actually pass, and you can see the, the official DSA logo and the date that it was taken. Oh man, it's got my address somewhere. Well, that's my previous address, so I was got my current address. That's fine. Um. Anyway, you can't see that, so um, so that's one of them. But I won't. I have to be careful now about how I show these. Um, so, uh, so that's one of them. This one's a more. This one's the motorbike one. Um, so, hang on a minute, I'm just trying to cover it up. So as you can see on this one, you can see the well. You can see the driving standards logo, driving driving standards agency, and the logo, and the date, and the, and the, and the date. Uh, yeah, you can see the date on there for. This is a motorbike, December twelfth. 2013, and you can see it says, con wait a con uh, "Congratulations, you have you have passed the motorcycle driving theory test. Your certificate confirming the pass." There you go. That's enough. So that's the motorbike license. That's the motorbike license. Um, and last but not least, the um, the current one that I've just just taken today. Um, I'm gonna try and be under 14 minutes because last time I took it last time and I did my uh, my uh, my my previous video. Of how to pass your theory test, I did it in four, did the did the whole video in 14 minutes. So I'm gonna try and be, be a bit quicker. Um, so, uh, oops. 
sí. So as you can see there, I'm just showing you to just I'm just showing you guys this so so it so so, so, so I can prove to you that I did actually pass my theory test three times without failing, and I would show you the failed certificate if I did fail it. I wouldn't exactly lie to you. You know me. You know me by now. You know I'm a Christian and that, so I wouldn't lie to you. So you can see the date there, Feb seventh of February. 7th of February 7th of February one minute 7th, uh, 7th of February 7th of February 2014 here if you can see that um so the, the DSA logo the driving standards agency logo and as you can see it says congratulations you have passed the car th the car driving so there is let me show it again probably not very clear now congratulations you have passed the car driving theory test your certificate confirming the pass is on the on the back back of the letter I think that says please something yeah so um I'll read it out to you what it, what it says about the part, the, the um, the actual. Uh, where is it? What time is it? Oh, I'm running out of time. Um. Yeah, here we are. It says the pass mark for for the multiple choice part is 43 correct answers at, out of 50 questions and for the hazard perception part is it is 44 out of a possible 75 points you pa you must pass both parts to pass the, th the driving theory test you score you s you scored 44 for the multiple choice part and multiple multiple choice part and 60 60 for the hazard perception part so um it was a bit low but I didn't get to finish the actual multiple choice questions properly because it was just it was just a bit of a difficult question because they weren't exactly the same like I said before anyway that's it um I've actually gone under my time which is just just yeah I'm just under my time so um hmm. so that's it um thanks for watching as well and god bless have a nice day nice day or night or whichever you want to call it and peace god bless now